towards end game, combo collector in the festival. Welcome to the top 10 highest CGZ combo sold on eBay for the week of December 25th, Christmas Day, to December 31st, New Year's Eve. Uh, any great book sold on Christmas? Stay tuned to find out. So coming number 10, we have Ultimate Fallout. Issue number 4, first print CGZ 9.4. This is a newsstand copy. Uh, newsstand stand itself for a little more than direct copy. Um, the asking price was $10,000, but it's actually sold for $8,000, which is still a lot of money, though, considering that this book is not really that old. Coming up number, number 9, Iron Man Fever, Las Vegas, issue number 2. This is graded CC, uh, 9.6, 9 signature series. that uh, got the uh, couple actors in this um, signature and also Stan Lee. Uh, this is for Night Down Dark. And this book, I was trying to want to stay away though. I mean, stay away from one each book. Um, some people could care less about autographs. So Night Down Dark is a lot of money for this book though. Coming number 8. We have Ultimate Fallout again. This is exactly the same one that I mentioned earlier. Uh, well, not, not exactly the same book, but uh, CC 9.4. Uh, this is a newsstand copy. Unfortunately, the um, the seller didn't buy it from the newsstand. Uh, could have gotten the more um, uh, people bidding on this book, though. This one sold for 10730 bits. Uh, the one I mentioned earlier, though, was also a 9.4, but that sold for 8000 so, so almost a little $3,000 difference uh, between... Uh, these two books, so even though they're exactly the same grade, uh, coming number seven, Fantastic Four issue one, CGC two point oh. This is the origin of first appearance of Fantastic Four. This one came out in nineteen sixty one. Uh, there was three bits on this book, and the final sold price of eleven thousand two hundred. Obviously, this is a uh, uh, one of those uh, grail books that should hold its value. I know the market has been down a little bit, but let's go over to the gold collect though. Let's see um, what gold collect say. So. Uh, this is all the Jack Kirby, um, the script right with Stan Lee. Uh, back then there was 36 pages. Let's go down here. So a 2.0 right here. Uh, Go class to get the market value 12,500. We scroll across. Uh, so the book is about right. Um, you got for 11 down 200. So uh, the book is trending down a little bit. But so it's a good buy though. Definitely, uh, you have the money. Definitely should get Fantastic Four. Have that in your collection there. Coming number six. All right, we have. A uh, Christmas Day book, I guess. Uh, so this book was sold on Christmas Day here. So it's on, someone must have gotten like a nice bonus or a nice Christmas present uh, that they can afford a high grail book. So this one is showcase number 22. Um, this one came in 1959, CC 6.5. Uh, Origin of first appearance of Silver Age Green Lantern. The asking price was $13,999, but it's actually sold for $12,250. Um, that's a that's a good book to have in your collection though, and uh, DC books don't go up in value as much as Marvel, but definitely a, a good book to have. All right, coming number five. All right, we have another Christmas Day book here. December this one sold December twenty fifth. Uh, this is X Men one. Greatest uh, CGC 4.5, first appear on the X-Men and Magneto. This one came out in 1963. Obviously, the you know, X-Men movie is sometime, it's coming soon though, haven't been announced yet. Uh, this one sold for $13,000. I, fortunately, I don't have an X-Men in my collection yet, so I'm still looking for it. Um, still waiting for the right time to buy and have this in my collection there. Coming to number four this week with Incredible Hulk issue one, CGC 2.5. Uh, this is, um, First appearance on the Hawk. This is the Grey Hawk, and he later become the Green Hawk later on. Uh, this one sold for fourteen thousand four hundred fifty with eighty eight bids. This is definitely a good buy. Uh, the Incredible Hawk, Fantastic Four issue one, and Amazing Fans fifteen. Those are all holy trinity of Marvel. Uh, they should hold their value in the long term. I know the book has been down a little bit. That definitely have, uh, want to have this in your um, personal collection there. Common number three this week, Amazing Fantasy 15 issue, um, I'm sorry, issue 15, this one came out in 1962, the first appearance of Amazing Spider-Man, uh, this is the great uh, CGC 0.5, um, even though it's 0.5, it's still sold for a big chunk of money, it's sold for $16,000, best offer, um, $16,000 best offer, it's actually sold for $16,000, but let's take a look at the, um, this website, so, we have, um, 0.5 right here, 0.5, let's scroll back a little bit, so back in November, 
transfers uh, from five so for thirteen thousand seven hundred, and now so for um, sixteen thousand dollars. So it's the marketing correcting itself, going back up. But if you look at it carefully, there is a big difference. though. this one that sold for the uh, three thousand dollars, it's a lot of discoloration though. I mean, this book has been exposed to the sun, and this one have a bit more vibrant color though. So definitely. Uh, if I have to pick, I definitely pick this one because this might have a higher resale value than this one, even though I have to pay the more upfront though for it. That's just my opinion. Let me know which one you rather prefer though. Um, the the low price one with discoloration, or the high price one with a little more uh, vibrant color. Coming number two this week with Green Lantern issue one CC six point zero. This one came out nineteen forty one though. Uh, six point but it does have white pages though, so that makes it a little more attractive to the 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 buy though. The asking price was twenty seven thousand five hundred, but it actually sold for twenty six thousand five hundred. So let's go over to uh go collect here. So here you are, go collect. Um, oh wow, look at that, sixty eight pages back then, and the cover price ten cents. So let's go down here. Um, uh, so six point uh, unfortunately. Um, last sold copy was uh, back in 2013, which is like 10 years ago, so for 6588 So you're looking at almost a $20,000 uh, jump though between 10 years though. Of course, you know, recent sold prices there. Common number one, we have Showcase 4. This is the first hand of the Flash. This is Great CC 5.0. After the Flash movie is coming soon from uh, Warner Brothers and DC. This one has now sold price of $29,995. And that's just uh, so what I price so, and it, we have another Christmas book right here. So, so this week we have um three Christmas book. I'm gonna zoom out a little bit. So it was a uh, showcase four, showcase twenty two, and then X Men one though. The three Christmas books made it to my top ten this week. Well, if you enjoyed the content, please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you next week. Bye.